Welcome to Refined Rap Trivia, brought to you by 1800 Tequila and Genius. I'm your host, Leti Peniche, and here with us today is Jordan, the winner of 1800 Tequila and Genius Refined Rap Trivia Contest. We've also got hip-hop expert Vic Mensa, who she'll be competing against in a trivia challenge that will put their hip-hop knowledge to the test. Let's see who's going to take home the prize. First question. Who produced Jay-Z's 2003 hit song, 99 Problems? Is it Timbaland, Rick Rubin, Kanye West, or Just Blaze? Vic. Rick Rubin. Correct. I'm keeping these on until I get one wrong. Question two. What is the title of J. Cole's debut mixtape? Is it Friday Night Lights? Any given Sunday, number one. Is it the come up or is it the warm up? Vic. The come up. That's correct. I thought you were going to go with the warm up there. A lot of people do. Jeez. Question three. Outcast is part of which Southern rap collective? <laughs> Dungeon Family. Correct, Dungeon Family. Jeez, I'm not giving you no competition <laughs> right now. We're at question four, guys. What TV show inspired the title of Pusha T's 2013 solo album, My Name Is My Name? Is it Breaking Bad, The Sopranos, The Wire, or Narcos? Vic. I'm gonna try The Wire. Correct, it's The Wire, there we go. We're almost halfway there. The score is 0-4. This one's tough. Which of these songs was not produced by Metro Boomin? Bad and Bougie by Migos, Future's Where You At, March Madness, or Purple Rain? Purple Rain. Wrong. Fuck. Bad and Bougie. Wrong. I guess that means I gotta take these motherfuckers off then. <laughs> take your glasses off, Vic. All right, neither one of them got a point on that question, so no one earns points this round. The score is still 0-4. Which city is Kanye West's song Homecoming in O2? Chicago. <laughs> Chicago. <laughs> Jordan, and you're from the shy. <laughs> Jordan got her first point. The score is now 1-4. Question seven. Who was the first rapper to win Album of the Year at the Grammys? Vic. Was that like Will Smith? No. Album of the Year, Vic. Now you have five seconds. Is it Jay-Z, Miss Lauren Hill, Tupac, or MC Hammer? I'm gonna go with Lauren Hill. You are right. Question eight. Which TV theme song does 3-6 Mafia sample on Put Your Signs? Is it Miami Vice, Magnum P.I., Knight Rider, or MacGyver? Vic. I want it to be Miami Vice. I don't even know the song, but... It is not Miami Vice. Okay. I want to say MacGyver. You're correct. MacGyver. Oh, the score is 3-4. Jordan is making an epic comeback. What is the title of Eminem's debut album? The Slim Shady LP, Infinite, The Marshall Mathers LP, or Relapse? Vic. The album. Is it... Slim Shady LP? It is not. It's infinite. You're correct. Jordan made an amazing comeback and now we're all tied up. This is the last question to break the tie. What is Raekwon's 1995 album, only built for Cuban Lynx, also known as? The purple tape. There we go. It was a tight race. Now we did have fun. Only one of you can take home the prize. Congrats, Vic, you're our champion. Thank you for playing. I want to dedicate this to Common, Jay Dilla, City of Chicago. It's for y'all, man. <laughs>